Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a what is in my diaper bag video for my nine week old, for my almost two year old, and for my four year old. If you're new here, my name is Jess. I would love it if you wanna stick around, hit the subscribe button, then check me out on Instagram. I also have it linked down below. If you think that it looks like I have an enormous shirt on, it is because I do. This is Russell's shirt. Um, I'm, you know, just hanging out in my house. Bear with the light quality here. Um, it is, again, raining. It's been raining for a few days now, and it's just like gloomy. Let's go ahead and get into this video. First things first, I'm gonna share the diaper bag that I have. Now, you'll see here, this is my diaper bag, and it looks like the Fawn Designs diaper bag. I know some people are against like knockoff things, but this is, I guess, a knockoff of Fawn Designs. I think I ordered it on Amazon. I'll, everything that I can link will be linked down below. But this is the Miss Fong diaper bag, and it was not, I mean, I think it was like $30. And I really like it. It's not too big, not too small. Um, it's got all kinds of different straps for it. A um, bunch of pockets, I guess, here in the front. Just all kinds of all kinds of stuff. And then it has a bunch of pockets on the inside. So I'll show you as I go through it. First things first, there is this pocket in the back. And it does come with... This happens to be right here. It does come with a diaper changing pad. I took it out because we have multiple kids in diapers, so I need more space for diapers. But it's pretty nice. Um, I would have it in there if I didn't have a two-year-old, or almost two-year-old that still has diapers. Currently potty training. Um, I'll let you know how that goes. But yeah, so I just have diapers back here. So these are Jay's diapers. They're kind of like the 360 diapers, and then I have Kai's diapers as well. I'm not gonna pull them all the way out because like you've seen a diaper, right? And I have wipes right next to that. So that kind of just buttons closed. And then an interesting thing about this bag is that it has a zipper to the bottom of that pocket, which is basically for like if you're traveling, if you've ever seen somebody like slide this onto their suitcase, that's what that's for. I don't really use it. I could use it to pull out diapers from the bottom, but I haven't used it much. Go over here to this side pocket. In this side pocket, I have a portable charger. Never know when we're gonna need, you know, to charge something up, so I just have kept that in there ever since we traveled to Oklahoma recently. And then you zip open this pocket, and I've got two pairs of sunglasses. Oh no! One pair's broken. <gasps> okay. If you know me personally, you know that my glasses are broken right here. Pretty much right in the same spot, but on this side, and I super glued them together. So, I have the lens in here, I could probably fix them, but these are kids' glasses. These are Mars and Jay's. Um, so maybe, I don't recommend putting them in side pockets like this. Maybe we use a hard case to, to put them in. All right, sliding all the way over to the other side pocket. I've got nothing in this zipper pocket, so I'm not gonna, sometimes I'll throw like chapstick or something in there. I'm not gonna show you that. But since I took out the other changing pad, this is a little bit smaller. So this is just one of those munchkin, you know, I don't know, changing pad covers, I guess, that you can put it down. But you can get like a three pack on Amazon for pretty cheap. I'll link these below as well. All right, and last for the outside, this front pocket. Like I said, I always have some sort of chapstick or something. That's just the Aquaphor chapstick. Nothing else in that pocket. And then Mara sneezes all the time. I think she has allergies. So I have Kleenexes right in the front here. And that's it for the outside of the bag. Now I'm going to open up into the inside. And the first thing I have is my wallet because it's just easy, easier access if I just set it right on top. And then I do have a kid's snack in here, and then Kai's, one of his toys that his great grandpa made him. So if you look inside, you can see, let me see if I can show you this. There's a zipper pocket here, there's a zipper pocket here. There is like a little pull-out pocket here. There are two pockets on the sides that are insulated. It's so hard to show you, like, there's an insulated pocket, there's an insulated pocket. I'll show you again once I have everything out of it. And then there's another zipper pocket 
right here on the inside and it kind of looks like it's supposed to be like the mom's pocket but I don't know and then there's two more of these little like just pull open pockets in the front so all in all there's one two three four five six seven eight pockets on the inside of this thing and it's loaded up it also has this little deal that you can like hook your keys to or something I don't know maybe I should hook my wallet into that so nobody grabs it there is this big section in the middle that I'm gonna pull this stuff out of so I'll show you what's right in the middle section I have three bags Sorry, I just had somebody walk down my street doing some weird stuff. I have these three bags that I got on Amazon. This is the Bumpkins brand. They make all kinds of like reusable bags, but these are just like cute little print. The first bag has snacks in it. I just thought I'd use this to kind of keep snacks contained. Clearly, I'm not following my own rules here. So let me throw that in there. And then the second bag, these are all different sizes. This all has like medical stuff in it. So I have Desitin, I have the Baby Bum sunscreen. I'm sorry, this is not focusing. I've got some hand sanitizer. I have a little first aid that has uh, band-aids and stuff. And then little packets, like the travel packets are really good to put in your diaper bag of Aquaphor and even like some baby uh, soap. So that is what's in this one. It's kind of like the medical medical bag. And then the third bag is the smallest one, and this is for me. What I have in here are panty liners. Sorry if that's too much information for you, but you know, I've got nipple pads, just a few different kind, and then tampons, just in case, because you never know. This would be something that I would usually carry in like a purse, so I just have it in here. Clear down at the bottom. I put this way at the bottom. It's my Moby wrap. Now, I don't know if they make this uh, pattern anymore, but you can get these like at Target, Amazon, maybe even Walmart now. But I just put that way down in the bottom so I always have a wrap with me. Now I'll go into the pockets. So this back pocket, all I have in here is a fan, portable fan. Got this at Academy, but just turn it on, it takes D batteries. I also, down in the very bottom of there, have, oh, I kept it, kept it on, whoopsie. In the very bottom of here, I have an extra thing of D batteries. I've got an empty pocket back here, and then this zipper pocket, I just put extra soothies, extra pacifiers. I keep it, because it's, since it's zipped, then they don't get all super dirty. The side pockets are clearly for bottles. Um, usually when we go places, I put, I'm doing a terrible job here. Usually when we go places, I put like my water bottle or the kids' water bottles in these because I'm still breastfeeding Kai. So um, I haven't had to really, unless I was going somewhere and was gonna like have a couple drinks, I, I would bring milk and put it in there, but haven't had too much. This little front pocket, I don't have anything in. That's really where I could keep my keys and stuff when I'm out and about, but usually I just kind of throw them in the top just like I, I would in like my purse or something. I say my purse like I carry a purse. I usually carry like a weird like fanny bag type thing. And the last two pockets are closed. So these very front two pockets, this pocket has socks. Whoopsie. Has socks and then there should be a couple hats. So this is more for like when fall comes around, we'll have some of these knotted hats. Again, I'll link all this stuff down. Whatever I can link, I'll link below if you're interested in any of it. It's just mostly things from like Amazon, Target, or Walmart. And then you should always have a change of clothes. I actually, we used one of our changes of clothes, so there's only one. And the best thing like right now in the summertime is just to put some onesies in there. Once it gets to be winter or fall i'll put a onesie with pants and then of course i already have the socks in there but i need to add another outfit in here and usually i just pick like something plain that's you know we can wear anywhere and that is it okay, one other thing that i don't have inside my diaper bag that I, but that i carry with us anywhere we go is a soothie with a pacifier clip i that i have like clipped on kai's car seat and then i also have like a little receiving blanket or a burp cloth or burp rag 
that um, I just kind of roll up and put with his car seat so it's always out. If it were to be like cold weather, I would obviously have like some sort of little lightweight blanket or even maybe a heavier blanket. I just thought I would throw that in there because I didn't have those inside my diaper bag. For what's inside the diaper bag. So you can see here that like you can fit these bags in the middle and then you've got all of the extra space. There's a lot of compartments in this bag. All right, I'm not sure if you can hear, but the baby just woke up. I don't know, he took like a 10 minute nap. Um, but I would highly recommend this diaper bag. I think it's cute. You can get them in like gray and black and I think even like blush. I just picked this because it was a little more neutral. It does have the gold like zipper and I haven't had any issues with the zipper yet. When it gets really super full and you pull on the top, this kind of, you know, gets this, it's not, it doesn't stay totally flat all the time, but I still don't, you know, I haven't had an issue with that. And then I always keep this hung up and I haven't had any issues here either. So I don't know, it has the regular backpack straps in the back and then it has stroller straps so you can hang it on a stroller or even I've hung it on the, what do you use at the store? The shopping cart. And then it comes with another like over the shoulder strap that I have upstairs in the baby's room that goes over like you can just put it on your shoulder. So if you wanna check this out, I will for sure link it down below. Anything else that I can link, I'll link. It's, it'll just be an Amazon link. So if you have Prime or something, you can get something like that. And I think that's gonna be it for this video. I've been wanting to show this diaper bag for a while and so I thought since I was gonna show it, I would go ahead and tell you what is inside of it. And that's gonna be it. I've gotta go pick up my baby because he is still whining. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I upload on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays and we'll see you in the next one.